frustrum is made by removing a small cone from a large cone. So a frustrum, so here we have a cone, and if we take out that small cone, the shape that we get left here is called a frustrum. The cones are mathematically similar. The large cone has a base radius of r and height 14. Given that the volume of the frustrum divided by the volume of the large cone is equal to 218 over 343, find the height 8 centimetres of the frustrum. So we need to find this height here of the frustrum. Okay, what we got, if we got the volume of the frustrum over the volume of the large cone, what we got here is the volume ratio of the volume ratio of the frustrum to the large cone. What we need to do is find the volume ratio of the small cone to the volume ratio of the large cone. So the small cone is this one here. So the volume ratio will be the small cone to the large cone, which is that one. Okay, so the volume ratio of the small cone is going to be 343 minus 218. So it's going to be 343 minus 218. That will give me the volume ratio of that compared with that one. And this one is 343. So that gives me 125 to 343. The length ratio is going to be equal to the cube root of 125 to the cube root of 345. The cube root of 125 is 5 and the cube root of 343 is 7. So we've got a length ratio. So the height of the smaller cone, which is this height here, is going to be 5 sevenths, because we're going from the larger to the smaller cone, so it's 5 over 7, times 14. Which is five sevenths. Okay, so five sevenths of fourteen. Well, seven goes into seven once and fourteen two times. Two two five is ten centimeters. So this height here is ten centimeters. Therefore, the height of the frustrum is going to be fourteen because the whole height of this one here is fourteen. Take away this one will give me the height of the frustrum. So fourteen minus ten gives me a final answer of four centimetres. So this height here is four centimetres. So this has been a video to show you how to find the height of a frustrum given using the idea of similarity. I hope you've understood and I thank you very much for watching.